Good evening. We are so happy that you're here. I do not know if Peter started the vlog already or not, but we vlog every single day. So if you like this video, we hope you'll return tomorrow. I just put in some potato wedges for dinner, buffalo potato wedges. We're gonna have some leftovers. Um, but before Peter gets home, I am going to finish getting ready and fold some laundry. <laughs> Alrighty, the potato wedges are going in. I put olive oil, buffalo sauce, salt, pepper, and garlic, just simple. Probably more, well, we'll have buffalo to dip them in, ketchup, all that good stuff. Um, but these are going in at 450 degrees. I'm going to check them at a half hour, but they'll probably need a little bit longer than that. So we have a lot of treats today. Peter actually sent me a little like care package um, today. Again, I'm not really feeling well, um, but he sent Irish soda bread and some vegan butter. These eight muffins. He got this Italian soda, also a lemon version. Um, everybody knows how much I love a good vacation drink. Look at that cutie in the background. And then some basics that we needed like bread, and a couple of other things. He also got me some flowers, I'll show you those. Um, but honestly, I think we need to go get some ginger ale and saltines. That's the biggest um, bit of advice I have found online to help soothe the stomach. I'm like, not a puker, guys. I will do anything not to puke, um, which I will have no control over sooner or later, I'm sure. Um, but I like to avoid that at all costs without feeling um, so belly achy all day long. Um, but that's just that's just where where we're at right now. Here are my pretty, very springy flowers. They're different than what typically Peter gets me. I love them. Also, the pillowcases we ordered last night already arrived. I love the sweater ones. It had a little bit more give than these ones. Our pillows, I didn't realize our pillows, they're just like stuffing on the inside. It's not an actual pillow within a case. And so I think we might either need to get a bigger size or I might need just Peter to help me because otherwise it looks fine. I just need it to zip. Um, but here are those other springy St. Patrick's Day colors. And then we got two of the, the sweaters, which I think are actually gonna stay out year round because really the color and whatnot like that could go for any season hey everybody i'm home from work we ate dinner um i stopped at walgreens got sarah saltines and ginger ale because her stomach has been hurting all day and now we're trying to figure out what we're gonna do it's seven o'clock new girls being really loud hold on work's been crazy busy my boss has been out of town this week he's on a well-deserved vacation but I work in an international hospitality timeshare company and uh, with this virus thing going on, it's like half of what we're dealing with, battling with. So work is stressful right now. We're going out though. We are going to go out Don't know somewhere. where. Where should we go? I think we just need to get in the car and drive. <laughs> just go. We ended up exactly where we did not think we were going to go. <laughs> Also, I did a costume change because we didn't realize that my injection spot was bleeding really Sarah bad. Sarah had a delayed bleed on her injection spot. Yeah, and then I got it out right away with water, peroxide, and, and spit. spit. I found it online. It worked so well if we ever need a trick. And now we have to wait in this guest relations line because Sarah realized halfway through our drive here that she didn't have a magic band. And for some reason, like a month and a half ago, we took... Usually we keep our cards in my wallet as a backup, but for some reason about a month ago Sarah took her Universal and Disney passes out of my wallet. Yeah. And Peter had four magic bands in the car. Sarah had zero. So now we're going to wait in this decent line Sorry. of guest relations to get a new card printed. With 15 minutes to spare until fireworks, we are next in line. We're going to have a fresh twist card. Are you excited? All right, six minutes till firework time. All they need to do is see a quick flash of an ID, and uh, we logged or gave them the email address on our account. For my Disney experience. And they gave us a new card. Easy peasy, in we go. We spoke too soon. 
There's issues at the gates. Well, well, well. <laughs> the plan was to watch the fireworks from behind the castle. We still might be able to make it back there. Oh, I think it, I think it'd be not be worth it. I think it'd, we should just enjoy it from the front. But we're in. We made it. And she has a bum card still. Yeah. She was straight up said, I see in sticker. the system that you are a pass holder. I can't get the card to work, but I'm gonna let you in. Yeah. Because there's an hour left of the day. <laughs> I saw these new additions online today. They added these all over property. Helping out with cleanliness. Check out the Haunted Mansion. Um, this lens teaches you to look at things you've never seen before. What are these paintings? It looks like the hashling, the sashling, the hashling sasher. That's the real That's Davy Jones. We got stopped two doom buggies away from the carpet to leave. Two doom bugs. We're free. We weren't stuck for very long. Um, there's about 10 minutes left in the park. What are you doing over here? So we just heard about the travel ban that goes into effect Friday for all of Europe except for the UK because I work in timeshare and that basically wipes out 20 20% of our operating. Well, I thought we were checking them. Oh, I thought we were checking. Wait, what'd you say? Oh, yeah. About 20% of my of like our our business for the next month. So I'm sure tomorrow is going to be a crazy day at work. So there is 10 minutes left in the park hours. There's a villain after hours tonight, but we're going to see if there's some rocking chairs and just hang out for 10 minutes. Oh, I can hear Splash Mountain. We should go on it. I should go on it. <laughs> you can if you want. There's only one chair. One, there's only one chair, and two, there's guests sitting around, around it. Not in the chair, okay. but around the chair. Let's check out Frontierland. Frontierland. Oh, yeah. Public outrage. <laughs> <laughs> Some people might think that it's crazy to come in the park just for an hour. But not the book cards. Sometimes you just need it, and it's sometimes the book way. yeah, especially this week. Like it's been a lousy week, my friend. Just, 
Just a little bit of pixie dust goes a long way. These and all the creatures of the night, welcome to this good I think at this point we can say officially we've snuck into Disney <laughs> After Hours villains. Yeah. We're about to get kicked out by Hades himself. I wonder if we said here how long it would take for a cast member to come over to us, <laughs> peaceful people sitting on these rocking chairs and be like, excuse me, what's your response for after hours? And then we get up and run. I'm gonna put in the footage of you and Katrina from the after out villains after hours we went to when she was on your shoulders. <laughs> That was a blast. <laughs> the dancing? Do the dancing one. Yeah. That was so much fun. Oh, they started the projections. Spooky grass in Frontierland. Wait, why are you going that way? We're going up through Adventureland. Oh, I thought we were going to go this way. Oh, no, no, no. We're definitely going to get caught if we go that way. <laughs> it's almost 10.30, so we've yeah, officially stolen. I'm actually a little bit nervous Like 30, it. like 15% of an it's after hours. we technically in the park right now. Yeah, they didn't even scan you in. We don't even know who you are. Nothing like the beginning of an After Hours Villains DJ party in the hub. Feels like run Disney morning. <laughs> that is the perfect way to describe it. Oh, should we just stay and crash the rest of Villains After Hours? We could get a ticket. On Main Street? Just kidding, there's a wall of cast members stopping people from... And I guarantee at some point they're going to slowly start marching down Main Street and kicking people out. Physically, taking them and kicking them. <laughs> Ooh, it's later than usual. What is today? Oh, today's the twelfth anniversary of my spinal, my spinal trans or my 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 spinal fusion surgery for my scoliosis. Don't start your day with broken pieces of yesterday. Every morning we wake up is the first day of the rest of our life. I like that a lot, especially with us having such a, a you know off week. Don't start your day with the broken pieces of yesterday is super important. You carry me. He's got the zoomies. And we love that onward song. It's in the it's the first song in the credits. Oh my gosh! Are you tired after that? I thought it was crazy, Evers. Lost your mind a little bit there. Are you ready for bed now? Eve's ready for bed. I'm ready for bed. Are you ready for bed? I guess. <laughs> well, that was an interesting Magic Kingdom trip, but it was fun nonetheless. Yeah. We did more than... I thought we would actually. We, we snuck into the villains after hours. And it's always fun when Eve gets the zoomies at the end of the night. Yeah. It's good to be home. It's good to be home. Oh, Eve just laid down. She just. Wait, okay, now she's. Comfy. She got like, had to readjust herself four times. Oh, now she knows we're talking about her, so she lifted her head up. <laughs> All right. It's good Have to a be great home. week. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>